माई नेम इज अनिक एंड टूडे वी विल बी पैच ऑफ द लास्ट टॉपिक लाइन बाई लाइन अनालिसिस विद द हेल्प ऑफ एग्जाम्पल्स एंड अंडरस्टैंडिंग इन अ मोर ब्रॉडर फैशन दिस इज अनालिसिस एग्जाम्पल नंबर वन हेयर इन दिस एग्जाम्पल वी आर गिवन एन एलग्रीदम वी आर सपोज टू फाइंड आउट द रनिंग टाइम ऑफ दिस पीस ऑफ कोड ओके सो we will be going to find out the running time using line by line analysis of the specific algorithm let's start line by line analysis so if we notice the first line this is just an assignment statement and will be taking constant time so it is running for only once so now at line 2 this is also an assignment statement and line 3 is also an assignment statement so it will be taking the constant time for its execution okay so now line at line 4 this is a while loop so this is going to run n time and n times okay from 0 to less than n it means that it will going to run n times so it will take n iterations to complete its execution now at line 5 it is an assignment statement but it will be running n times because it is under the influence of this while loop same for line 6 and 7 these are also assignment statements and under the influence of while loop so it will complete its execution after running n times now at line 8 this is also an assignment statement so this will also take one constant time for its execution to complete okay so this is the number of times each operation is going to run okay so after summing up all these we get the running time of uh, this specific code that is 4n plus 4 okay so let's move to another example uh, analysis example number 2 so here is another example of line by line analysis of algorithm topic and this algorithm we are again given an, an algorithm and we are supposed to find out the running time of this piece of code okay so what will be the running time of this code section Let's start by analyzing the first line, which is just simply the assignment statement. So it will be going to take uh, just one constant time for its execution. Now at line two, this is the while loop and will be running n minus one times. Why? Why n minus one times? Because if you notice the i-th initial value, the i-th initial value is one, and this while loop is going to run less than n. so which means that the while i is less than n which will never be equal to n so it will takes n minus 1 iterations to complete uh, its execution so we we take it as n minus 1 times so now line 3 and 4 will run uh, n minus 1 times because it is under the influence of while loop and hence it will be going to run n minus 1 times okay so at line 5 uh, here the maximum rule will work uh, what is maximum rule um, i have already covered this in the previous video if you have not watched that video yet then please watch that video before watching uh, this part because that video is worth to watch in that video i have covered if else loops assignment statements etc etc uh in more detailed and broader fashion so that the understanding of this topic may be developed thoroughly okay so line 5 will run only for one time and after this we have two sections one is this and one is this and we have to select one of them using maximum rule okay so here are two sections and we need to count the number of times operations executing in each of the sequences so these two sections are the sequences of instructions and we need to count the number of iterations executing in each of these sequences separately okay and then which one is maximum of the two will be the running time of this part of the algorithm that is if else part so this is the running time okay so after adding up all this we will be getting this running time 
so one is uh, this one is this and 3 and minus 1 is uh, summing up after uh, summing up these and one is representing the if con uh, if condition which always will be executed but as uh, i have described earlier we have to select uh, each of this which is a maximum so because these are these are both are same so i am selecting uh, one of them which is which is equal so i have written one over here okay so uh, computing it after computing this i get 3n Need more examples? More examples are in the next video which is more complex and you will find it very helpful. I am updating the link in, uh, to the next video in the description below. And if you have not uh, subscribed yet then please do subscribe. This will be very helpful for me. Thank you. Bye.